Today we're going to be reading Element One of your Optavia Life Book. My name is Christy Baker and I'm a certified Optavia Health Coach. And I wanted to bring this amazing resource to you because it just hasn't been done before. So my only request <laughs> is for you to please like and subscribe to the channel so you know when the next video is coming out so we can together move through your life book. And my third request is please share this with anybody that you know that is also doing Optavia. Let's get everybody into our life books. Okay, let's get started. Element one, being clear why you are here. The average time to complete this chapter is one week. And in element one, we will identify why you are here and share the importance of intrinsic motivation in your life and explore in your words why you are ready to begin now sure why our paths are crossing at this moment in your life, but I imagine it's because you're ready to make a change. I'm glad you're here. I admire your courage in stepping out from the masses and making a crucial decision to improve yourself. Let me say before we go on that helping people transform their lives is a mission that I care deeply about. I know that if you're ready to make changes in your life to improve your health and well-being, then this system can help you. For many, it may start with losing weight, becoming more active, sleeping better, and reducing stress. There are great starting points in improving health. They are what I describe as macro habits of health. We will take one small step at a time to help you achieve what you want. In conjunction with Dr. A's Habits of Health book, in each element of your life book, we will discover explore and install a specific element that will allow you to, su to sustain a lifelong transformation. We will fill your life with the rocks, the pebbles, the sand, and finally the, the water. For that complete illust illustration, please look back into the introduction for more information on that. Element. The definition is a fundamental and essential piece of the whole. So let's get started with the first basic element. Why are you here? Understanding your why or your motivation for change is a key element. It's essential to making lasting change in our behavior and habits. As you read this, you may be feeling pressure from your significant other, your healthcare provider, your boss, or your friends, or it could just be a voice in your head saying, I should or I ought to make a change. It's important to take note of those reasons, but in this element, we are going to start by taking a closer look at what is really important to you rather than any emotional conflict that may have brought you to this point. Motivation that's driven by loved ones in an interpersonal conversation will not last long. If you want to find out why, take a look at part 1.3 of Dr. A's Habits of Health are you ready to change? If we are motivated by those types of emotions and feelings, we are likely to look for quick fixes and to find help from someone else rather than to look for ourselves. When we look outside of ourselves, we are giving away any power we have to make real change in our life. We are going to tap into something much more powerful, the core element of real change. Your why is your intrinsic motivation and your highest stimulus for change. It drives you into action because it's what you want to do. It inspires you to grow and be better. And when you're doing something that inspires you, you want to share your desire with others and increase your level of engagement. It creates a whatever it takes mindset and becomes a powerful ally in your path to success. That level of engagement and passion might have eluded you for quite some time, perhaps even since childhood. The default program for adult life is one of distrust, caution, and an inner voice that says, no, you can't. Our biology likes to say the same, and our mind likes to say the same as well. I would like to close that old book and open up this first chapter of your new story by asking you a few questions. 
I want you to answer them from your heart or your gut. Don't overthink or rationalize what you think you can or can't. Ready? Okay. Number one, do you really care about getting healthy? Number two, do you really want to improve your life? I thought so. It tells me that you do value your health and your life. Put what you think you can do to one side of one side for the rest of this element and explore why you want to change and what is possible. For the moment, let me worry about how we are going to make your transformation a reality. This is a journey that we will be on for the rest of our lives. So we've got plenty of time. Let me give you an example of our vision as you step forward into the journey. We will be exploring what is important to you and how you can create a better life through awakening possibilities. We will then set you into a specific process and do the work. The path that I'm going to lay out for you in the elements of your life book will allow you to stay focused on what comes next. Step by simple step, we will lay the foundation for amazing things, but only if you are willing to, the, to do the work and stay the course. I'm talking about filling your days with vibrancy in your physical health, achieving a state of calm, joy, spiritual strength, and having great relationships with family and friends, getting up every morning and loving what we fill our days with. And we'll create security in our resources and hugely support our surroundings with time to enjoy it all. These type of transformations can be possible if you are willing to grow and do the work. I will share stories of transformation throughout our time together. Before we get into the questions, let me say that it's fine if you just want to lose some weight, but filling out your why in terms of your health and well-being is a powerful way of tapping into your deepest aspirations and unlocking your potential for more in life. It's worth the time it will take. Remember, we're starting to write the next chapter in your story, and we want to awaken the inspirational thoughts and things that are important to you, which will give you lifelong satisfaction. Stay tuned for our next video. We're finishing on page 41, and we'll pick up with that tomorrow.